Hello folks, Luke Simons with you. Back to the basics 101. Wife's making some caramel rolls. She's making some eggs. Got a buddy of mine, rancher buddy, um, coming over, picking up some telephone poles. Stay tuned, you're gonna be intrigued. This is just one more way to use a pick and roll. You're gonna love it. Cut them out, Cut them out so that's a movable pin. Yeah, you can pull a pin in and out. I like that. I really like that. Near ranching, homesteading, etc., learn to get along with your neighbors. I'm telling it sounds funny that I would have to talk about this, but in today's age, we have lost our sense of community. We have lost our culture of being friendly one to another. Now, this is the second commandment in the Bible. The scripture also says, and I will put these scriptures up for you, that he that has many friends showeth himself Good. friendly. Learn to get along with folks. Now back to the pick and roll. Pick and rolls are a vital piece of equipment if you're ranching. Um, of course, you generally use this for feeding hay, etc. I am going to make a whole series of videos just on the powers of what this does. Now, this buddy of mine, he uses his for everything absolutely everything and I hope to do more videos uh, with him because he has some really neat attachments that go on to this pick and roll um, just a neat guy rancher buddy of mine Buddy of mine, he's a good, good operator and not hard on equipment. This buddy of mine will take the fuse out of his pickup in the four wheel drive mode so that the pickup has a low range. The rear end isn't locked in with the, the four wheel drive and the, the front end um, is free. So he had to put his fuse in quick to put it in four or low. For a little more clarity, what he did is he takes the fuse out for the transfer case. So the four wheel drive is not, it doesn't engage, it's disengaged. But the rear end still will go into that really low. So you put it in four low, and basically you made yourself a two-speed rear end. Now this is the part I was worried about. See if it happens. Clear. Still? Now basically what you're doing here is you pull it up as far as it'll go, you back it up, loosen the chain up, and choke the chain back up again, and you're just pulling it back up, just pulling it up. That's all you're doing here. Uh, when you're homesteading, ranching, farming, it pays to have friends. You can, friends are undervalued every single time. 